hello everyone welcome back to my channel and today in this video i'm gonna be showing you how to fix user emulator from crashing when loading shaders so let's get started as you can see i have metroid dread when i open it in my user emulator it will crash when loading shaders to fix this issue right click and remove all files that catches click here and click on yes yeah. and right click and remove option and remove walking python catch click on yes yeah. okay and right click go to remove and remove opengl python catch and click on yes yeah. and okay and go to file open user folder and delete your shaders folder from here delete it and it's done and another solution of this problem go to keys and update your proud keys and title keys so i have already updated keys for my user emulator and close it and guys if you are using user emulator first time so you will have to do some settings for your uh, pc so go to search bar and type your ms config and press enter and go to boot options go to advanced options and you have to uncheck this option maximum memory so i show you my pc specification i am using 8gb ram as you can see install the memory ram 8gb so i can play switch games and use the emulator because my pc is good to run use the emulator so close it close it so uncheck it and check this option and select big number from here because my PC is 4 core and OK and apply and OK and restart your PC now after restarting your PC reopen your user emulator and another solution of this problem go to control panel for your NVIDIA or AMD or whatever you are using graphics card in your PC and go to adjust image settings and you have to select performance from here check this option and select performance check this option click on apply and go to manage 3d settings and scroll down and go to power management mod select maximum performance and scroll down and go to texture filtering quality select high performance from here and click on apply and go to configure surround and select from here your GPU so you have to select powerful GPU from here and click on apply and go to system information and make sure you are using updated drivers for your GPU. So as you can see, I have driver version 496.49. So I have already updated drivers version for my GPU. So if you are using old version drivers, so please update drivers for your GPU. And close it and close it. You can play any switch game in use emulator without any problem so i play this game and here we go and one more important thing guys if your nsp or xci file doesn't work then re-download the game and try again in your user emulator because many nsp or xci files are corrupted and they cannot run in user emulator because some nsp or xci files are not playable with the update then you can change base game, NSP or XA file or using a user emulator with the update. So as you can see, my game is working 
and I have no issue on startup and use the Amazon for this game. So hope you like this video. If you like so please hit the red button, subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.